Most U.S. corn farmers have been struggling with their crops this year due to the lack of rain. Overall production is forecast to fall nearly 13 percent compared to last year. Nebraska, there's a lot of challenges there. Iowa, Kansas, Missouri, Indiana, Illinois, that's again those are top producing states for corn and uh, we uh, we hear challenges in all of those. But across most of Minnesota things are looking up. Jonathan All of Peterson Farm Seed says many farmers are a couple weeks away from harvesting and about three to four weeks ahead of schedule. A nice change after years of wet harvests. This is very good. Uh, we're a bit on the drier side but uh, again the prices are good. The, the yields look to be better than average and uh, there's uh, good conditions uh, looking to uh, be able to harvest a crop. Nationally, corn yields are expected to average out at about 123 bushels per acre. That's the worst that national average has been since 1995. But in much of North Dakota and most of Minnesota, yields are expected to do quite well. We're pretty blessed in that sense, the fact that uh, with the uh, lack of moisture that we've had, that uh, the, the crop is looking and uh, hearing to be uh, as good as it uh, could could be. Whereas in the years past, we've had a, we've uh, battled with a lot of uh, wet fields and uh, too much moisture. It's uh, it's a nice change. When it's all said and done, Minnesota farmers are expected to harvest nearly 156 bushels per acre. That's nearly the same as last year, but it would be the highest yield in the Midwest, which would translate to farmers cashing in on the high prices. Eric Crest, Valley News Live. Uh.